a good example of what our state is facing is that um, 80 percent of your sons and daughters, our sons and daughters, uh, who are intelligent, go through school, get good grades, do their undergraduate work, and then apply for medical school in the state of Washington, are turned away. 80 percent. I have a neighbor who's a physician. His son was the valedictorian in high school, did undergraduate at Dartmouth, did really well, applied for medical school in the state of Washington, and was rejected. Why? Why isn't someone who grows up in this region, who'd be willing to practice in this region, why is it we can't have them go through medical school? Because there aren't enough seats. And this is why it's essential to expand medical education in Spokane, to allow for kids from our community and all across this region to be able to go to medical school in their home state and then stay here and practice medicine.